Today, Montreal Mayor Denis Coderre announced his response to the horrible uh, death of the woman in Pointe aux Trembles who was uh, apparently killed by her neighbor's pit bull about 10 days ago. The mayor announced he will be bringing in a bylaw in September. The way it works, you have to put up a motion so that the, the Council of September to adopt it in, uh, in August to adopt it in September. Uh, we have also to take a look at what's going on because, as you noticed, the Minister Coiffure and Couillard, Prime Minister Premier Couillard, said that they will, at the opening of the new session, which is in September, probably they will have also legislation. But I'm not going to wait for a, a law of legislation because, uh, at the end of the day, if you have a legislation, how, how are you going to apply it? So it's, it's going to be through rules. Will require pit bull owners to get permits for their dogs, as do all dog owners. However, uh, pit bull dogs and pit bull mixes will have to be sterilized in order to get a permit. They'll have to prove that they've been sterilized. Um, they will also have to be muzzled in public. And uh, the mayor introduced a new uh, squad of uh, canine inspectors that will be ensuring that backyards uh, where pit bulls are present are in fact safe uh, and closed. Yeah, yeah. Specifically, telling you what we will do with the pit bulls, but. Uh through, we have a group here since 2012 of experts and we will all work together from the legal department through the SPVM, through the inspectors and that's why NHPAW is here to uh, the consultation of all the boroughs so we can make sure that everybody uh, kind of sing the same tune with his own sensitivity of the field and with, uh, and with any. Because in 2018 we will have a major center that we are building. The reason why we've been saying that it's going to be up to 2018 it's because you already have regulation that exists in the borough, but uh, we had to, uh, the, uh, the, the goal to uh, by 2018 to make sure that we will have a uniform uh, regulation. Now, of course, with uh, what happened to Madame Valnet, we needed to uh, react accordingly, and that's the reason why we uh, put uh, the pressure a little bit uh, more to, uh, to address it immediately. And is it going to require any new training for police officers to be able to identify a pit bull or identify a, an aggressive weapon? Well, they already have that. When we talk about identification, is if they have their medals, if the dogs have the medals, so that's a kind of, and, and uh, if they don't have their leech, if they don't have their leech, well, they will have to, uh, to face the consequences, as, as simple as that.